Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. Alright, well he's one of the more accomplished Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu practitioners in this division, DC, and I know how many chokes you have in your arsenal. Offensive Jiu-Jitsu, defensive Jiu-Jitsu doesn't get much better than this guy. It doesn't get as high level in terms of Jiu-Jitsu knowledge. He knows in every exchange that he's the guy that's processing things at a different level from the armbar submissions that he has shown in the octagon to the beautiful guillotine chokes that he does over and over again. And don't think that he won't roll for a knee bar and get a submission. Right. It's just constant danger when you're in the jiu-jitsu with this guy. And even the high-level wrestlers that he's fought have paused to try to take him down because of that patented guillotine. It's so truly a case of pick your poison with this Brazilian jiu-jitsu practitioner. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes, would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. And now our tail of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Kiesa is one year the elder. He will have a three-inch reach advantage. Here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Levin. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a jiu-jitsu fighter, holding a professional record of 17 wins, four losses. He stands six feet one is tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Spokane Valley, Washington, Michael Maverick Kiesa! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the right corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting at Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce the Dragon Lee. Okay, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. You ready? You ready? All right, so here we go. The weight and the height gives way to the action right here on one side. Maybe the division's most well-rounded fighter. Taking on arguably the biggest submission threat in this game. Because he's such a great submission grappler, I believe that this is the most dangerous fight for him in the division. Wow. He needs to maintain his pace, stay away from this guy at all costs, and force him to stand up with him. Beautiful leg kick thrown. Wow, what a kick. Huge kick lands. Trying to establish that jab once again. Just out of range with that right hand. Get those combinations going. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Look at him working at 
trying to shut the liver down. Try to establish that jab. Put your hands up higher. Come on. Back to the well with that right hand. It's no good. Still nice body kick lands. Attack the head now. Nice punch by Lee. I mean, he's cutting down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Counters with that inside leg kick. Just unable to quite find that range. Nice sneaky head kick. And both guys really throwing with authority. Big ball for what's land. Now he gets back to range. All right, so he lands another jab now, just snapping that thing off. I believe that the jab was lost in mixed martial arts initially. But now it has been found, and it's been found by this young man in this octagon tonight. Very tricky when he throws that body kick. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, nice move of the body for him there. Very nice. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Oh! He's in trouble. He's first oh, he might be out. And what a round! Hey man, settle down. Listen, you are taking way too much damage to the body, man. All right, let's get you some highlights from that previous round, DC. I don't care how strong your core is. You can't take too many more of those body kicks. John, you can't train for that. I mean, you cannot train to take those types of body kicks. They start to really wear at your gas tank, and then you start to make mistakes. When you take that many body kicks, you start making mistakes, and before you know it, the fight's over. All right, DC, Ready? buckle up. Here we go with our next round. High number of kicks. Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. of inches right there, yeah. boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Effective strike there by Lee. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. And that one certainly found the target. Oh, that's a good right hand. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting the combination. I mean, <laughs> if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combo. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. We'll finish this Oh, he might be out. Oh, nice job to land the knee there by the taller fighter, and... I think I just heard Daniel Cormier say, I wish I was a little bit taller. You're a baller, though. Hands higher, hands higher. Lee gets touched by that kick right to the body there. Nicely done by the opponent. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Decent right hook attempt, but it's no good. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denial. Oh! He didn't like that left hand. He's got him right here. He has to pouring it on. Can't take many of those. Better check. Lee gets hit by that kick to the midsection. You got to do better defensively. Oh! He's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Both of these gentlemen are putting it on the line. Oh, he might be out. He ate that kick. He took that whole kick. Yep. And he connects with the punch there. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Throwing that jab now again, the fighter of eights. Oh, nice 
straight left there. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Yes, lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Ten minutes in the books. All right, so there's the end of the round. He stayed committed to doing damage upstairs and landed a seminal blow in that round. It was accumulation of those strikes. He kept hitting him over and over to the head. Eventually, he found the, the one that really did damage his opponent. Strike to the body, not a ton of real estate there, but he certainly found it. Look at the force behind that leg kick. A swing and a miss. Oh! Holy smokes, he put him to sleep. That one was thrown to end the fight. Yep. <laughs> oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Hard to get up again, but he looks like he's compromised. Wow! He's in trouble. He's hurt man. Oh, straight right. Well, he continues to land a high number of straight. Oh! He's out! Wow! Wow! Yeah, that right there is a high-level knockout, ladies and gentlemen. Crowd absolutely loving it. Just a perfect shot to end the fight, landed flush. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming. So a huge, huge win for that young fighter here tonight. All right, let's take a look back at the replay. It ends up a knockout, but this was really a striking clinic from the moment they touched him. I mean, a competitive fight that one guy finally found the shot that ended the fight. But both of these warriors displayed a ton of heart. One guy got the finish, but neither guy should be disappointed in their performance. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at 1 minute, 30 seconds of round number 3. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon! Thank you for watching. Please wait for more videos. See you soon.